Good Morning America is brought to you by Ensure. Enjoy the complete balanced nutrition of Ensure. Time for Pop News. Oh, Rachel, yeah. what's cooking? Oh my gosh, some fun stuff this morning for you guys, and good morning to all of you. Great good morning, here. Rachel. Yeah, it's we haven't great heard to from have you, you enough until now. Oh yeah? All yeah. right, well here we go. Listen up. Yeah. So first up, the mega hit show Hamilton is heading to the White House. The cast of the wildly popular Broadway production is being welcomed by the First Lady, Miss Michelle Obama, tomorrow for what promises to be one amazing event, and the cast couldn't be more excited. We're going to be trying out our educational program with some kids. We're going to do a concert for the first family, and we're going to shoot so many ham for ham videos from there. You have no idea what's about to hit you. They are doing great things. The show is also providing ten dollars tickets to students who want to see the show. I'm right. dying, dying, Ditto. dying to see this. It is incredibly hard to get a ticket. Yeah, I know. But everybody says it is extraordinary, extraordinary. I know, and good on them for doing something really great and positive with all their success. Absolutely, you know? yes. Very creative way to uh, get education in there. Teaching history in such a I know, way. really fun way. Love it. All right, well tonight's LA Clippers game is sure to be special. That's because of a guest who stopped by practice and brought a little Disney magic to the court. It turns out today's practice is gonna be a little bit different. We have a special guest and his <laughs> name is Mickey Mouse. Mickey's a basketball genius. <laughs> his methods are unconventional, and I don't always understand them. I just know he's operating on a higher level. For three. Oh, yeah, I like that. <laughs> Mickey's got moves on the basketball court. All right, well, those Cavs, they better watch out after that lesson, all right? Almost should be a fun night at uh, the same <laughs> Yeah, almost as good as play ball. We should say, we should say that uh, Disney, Disney is owner of ABC News, and uh, we have a lot of Disney paraphernalia around the house, my kid. Addicted to Mickey Mouse. Oh, stop I mean, it. We is know is you it? run around with the ears Well, yeah. that's okay. also true. <laughs> that is also true. All right, true. moving on, guys. The hashtag Ariana on SNL is still trending this morning after singer Ariana Grande pulled double duty, both performing and hosting on SNL last night. Incredible. You mind if I just Google that right yeah. now? I'm like <laughs> totally intrigued it's, to hear all It was awesome. She might have better moves than Channing. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> That's no, well, hey guys, we have, we have got to get to this. Uh, the, these are the latest images burning up the internet. They'll either make you hungry, want to cuddle, or perhaps both. <laughs> Here in Zach of Portland, Oregon, created galleries comparing dogs to food. Like <laughs> these kind of pictures, uh, which asks labradoodle or fried chicken. So, what do you guys say? What do you think? Which one's the fried chicken? Which all, one's the labradoodle? They're all fried chicken, right? No, no the ones food? on the right, the labradoodle, the one on the left, uh, fried chicken. Then oh, we have the, uh, oh a puppy God. or a bagel. Yeah, like, that great. is that's incredible. <laughs> um, it's so many fun ones, and uh, now people are chiming in with their own you Did know, you bring us any food, Rachel? Yeah, that not, you made us hungry? I know, I'm sorry. But you know what? Oddly enough, Karen, she does not have a dog. She actually has a cat named Toast. And she's been posting all these pictures that have gone viral. I just thought that was too funny not to throw into the mix there. Do your cats look yeah. you like any food, Dan? My yeah. cats look like meatloaf just sitting around. <laughs> wow. All day long. What do I do? Sorry, cats. Stay tuned for George yeah. with this week. Thanks for joining us.